What is up everyone? Welcome back to my channel. So for today's video, I'm going to be showing you guys, well I'm actually, I'm going to be following Claudia Regalado's video on how to make the best strawberry and Nutella French toast roll-ups. So I seen that she did this video and it looked so bomb. I tried to make it yesterday. I kind of did like a practice run yesterday with my nephew. I'll put in a little bit of clips so you guys can see how that went. Andrew. Say what's up to AJ Squad. Please. What's up, AJ Squad? Yes, subscribe to AJ Squad. Don't forget to give it a like. Don't forget to give it a thumbs up. And put it on Roblox. I'll put and on Roblox too. Yeah. And put up put up us on our name is Andrew bro, and Thea. Bro, Andrew and Thea. Bro, why do you have slides on your hands? Why do you got chunkless on your hands? I'm Bumblebee. You're Bumblebee. <laughs> <laughs> okay, look. Look at what I have. I have strawberries and bananas. Do you like strawberries and bananas or just strawberries? Just strawberries. You don't want strawberries and bananas? No. Okay. <laughs> so funny. Okay. Don't don't smash it too hard. Why? Because you don't want to rip it. Why? Because if not, yours is going to be broken. Then I'm not going to start playing. So this is what we're gonna do. You're gonna grab some Nutella. Yeah. And you're gonna put it on your bread, mm. like this. Can I put it on my bread? Yes, I'm gonna give you a spoon. She made it look so easy. I think my Nutella's too Hey! It's chocolate. Yeah, it's just chocolate, bro. Okay. Now, the next step is we're gonna put strawberries and- But, am I gonna lose? No, you're not gonna lose. Everybody wins. Okay. Now, we're gonna fold it. Hey. <laughs> okay. It's just chocolate, huh? It's just chocolate. Okay. Mm. Are you ready to fold it now? Look, you go like this, and you fold it. Fold it. Just like that. Just like this? And then it should be like this. Like this? Good job! Can you open it now? Good. Who wants to eat dirty? Hey! It's just chocolate, Bill. It was really fun, it got super messy, but I kind of learned that I used way too much chocolate yesterday and I wanted to reattempt it because I didn't get to really enjoy it the way I wanted to. So I already have all my strawberries cut. I started with cutting my strawberries. After that, I cut all the crust from the bread and I started to smash them. In her video, she was using one of those little brown roller things, which I don't have, but I did have one of the tortilla smashers. So I ended up using that to smash the bread and it worked perfectly. So now I have that. So the next step is gonna be me putting the Nutella and stuffing it with the strawberries. So I'm gonna be showing you guys how I do that. If you guys are ready for this video, don't forget to give it a thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe down below if you guys are new. Let me know if you guys have tried this recipe before. I love crepes, so I feel like this reminds me of crepes almost. Um, but let me know if you guys have tried this. I'm gonna start with getting some Nutella. And I'm gonna focus more on getting that on the side. Grab some strawberries and stuff that, and then you're gonna roll it. You know, I got practice doing that. And 
Now basically stick on the end with that Nutella that you put there. So I now have all my roll-ups that are filled with Nutella and strawberries. These actually came out a lot better than they did yesterday. I think because they don't have as much chocolate and I think they have a lot more strawberries. So I think these are going to be a lot better. So now the next thing that I'm going to be doing is I'm preheating um, the, the pan right now. It's on medium heat and I'm going to start making the egg batter. So for the egg batter, she has ground cinnamon, vanilla, honey, two eggs, and I think that's it. So that's what I'm going to be doing right now, and then we'll start dipping them, and then we can start frying them or cooking them. can start the egg batter done and I have all of my roll-ups ready I've already had my stove I mean my pan preheating on medium heat so I'm gonna start with putting some butter on the pan and then we're gonna start dipping them and I'm gonna do just rolling it just putting it on How we do it you're basically gonna want to cook them on about one minute on each side or until it's about golden brown so I'm gonna let them cook for a little bit I am gonna leave her video linked down below for you guys so if you guys want a, a actual step-by-step -step video she explains everything really good I'm just following her steps and it's looking hella good you guys I'm so excited to eat this I'm just gonna wash my hands while this cooks and then we're gonna come back and we'll start turning them That's what they look like getting out of the oven so what i need to do now is basically prep the plate and add little things to it so let's go ahead and do that now i'm so excited because we're almost close to the taste test i'm gonna start prepping the plates and i'm gonna start with two plates and i'm gonna put two on each one have some powdered sugar Just fill the whole plate so it looks really nice. And then we're gonna get I'm gonna add some strawberries on top. Oh my gosh, this looks so bomb. <laughs> 
look so bomb, you guys. And the last thing we're gonna add is gonna be the chocolate syrup. Before my camera dies, That is what it looks like. I'm gonna be doing a taste test on the next camera, so stay tuned. All right, you guys, it's time for the taste test, so I'm gonna be trying it out. I think the second time around it was a lot better because I didn't use as much chocolate so I don't feel like my mouth is filled with a lot of chocolate. I'm able to taste a lot more of the fruit with some chocolate in there and it tastes really good. I think I ended up putting a little bit more cinnamon this time because I can taste it a little bit more and it tastes really good. It really tastes like French toast. So thank you so much um, for the recipe. If you guys want to check it out, I am going to leave a link down below so you guys can see it and you guys can follow it too. Let me know if there's anything else you guys want me to try. Let me know what you guys think of this and I'll see you guys in the next one.